A cry by the residents of Nyamgano area in Mtoko, about 100 kilometers of Harare. They are mobilizing against the evictions and human rights abuses they claim to face from Chinese mining companies in the area. Some of these companies, including Bozimo Granite Mine, were given licenses by the government to mine black granite on traits of land belonging to people causing water pollution, land degradation, and health hazards, among others. The Environmental Management Agency did not deny these allegations. They said the department has had engagements with the affected villagers. They do what are known as biannual monitoring, where we go and check uh, if the companies are adhering to the what they have written in the EIA documents. So if there are any violations, of course, here and there, but they are not as pronounced as maybe the community might want to say. Angry villagers say they are not sure what the future holds as the Chinese companies are mining an area that stretches over 150 hectares and it includes some of their homes. More than 20 families have been forced out this far. Mining. During our visit to Bozimo Granite Mine, it was business as usual. Our request to speak to the management was unfruitful, as they did not want to be recorded. But we witnessed tons of minerals being mined and transported to an unknown destination. Though mining plays an important role in the socio-economic development of many countries, what Zimbabwe is experiencing is described by some as an environmental catastrophe. Since 2018, Zimbabwe and China have been accused of paying legal attention to the environmental damage.